You had no interest in this cat. Your Honor, I had a lot of things going on. There was a cost to foster her feline. And you agreed to pay her $100 a month to do that. That's correct. You're a couple of hundred dollars behind. Then it was a game of cat and mouse for the cash. I said, we have an agreement that you would pay this. Her response was, I'm happy to pick the cat up and take it to the Humane Society. How long did you keep the cat? I still have the cat. Judge Judy. Alyssa Dawson is suing Nancy Morton for the unpaid balance on an agreement to foster her cat. Order. All rise. That's yeah, case number 393 on the calendar in the matter of Dawson versus Morton. Thank you. You're welcome, Judge. Parties have been sworn in. You may be seated. I'm going to start with you, Miss Morton. Miss Morton, you had a cat that you found that you could not take care of because there was some damage in your home. When was that? To find the home, August. The time that you put an ad. In August of 2018. And you put an ad on Craigslist or mm -hmm. Facebook? What? Yes, both. For somebody to foster your cat. That's correct. And in August of 2018, how many animals did you have? Two. What two animals did you have? A cat and a dog. Did you also foster the dog? No, the dog was allowed to stay in the hotel that we were staying at. But not the cat? It was limited to one animal. How long were you in the hotel? Five and a half months. Did your insurance pay for that? Yes, he did. How many people were in the hotel? Four. On what date did you move back into your house? Uh, November 22nd. On what date did Miss Dawson agree to foster your cat? August 15th of 2018. And you agreed to pay her $100 a month to do that? That's correct. And you paid her on August 15th $100? Uh, no, I paid for her afterwards. When in afterwards? In October. October 2018. So you didn't pay her anything in August? No. Zero in August, zero in September. Mm -hmm. In October, you sent her what? $100. Well, now, you're a couple of hundred dollars behind. Well, it was, it was from August 15th the 15th of each month. Well, August to September is I one month. I was behind, Your Honor. You were behind. Right. August to September is one month. September to October is another month, so you were two months behind. Correct. When was the next time you gave her money? November. How much? $200. Did she give you $200 in November? No, ma'am. How did you give her the $200? I wrote a check. I'd like to see it. I don't have the check with me. That's too bad. That's what you're doing here today. How did you pay her the $100 in October? A check. Do you have that with you? No, I don't. When did she give you money? She sent me a check that was dated August 25th. I received that check and deposited into my bank. For how much and on what date? $100 on August 28th. So I'm incorrect. After that, you received nothing? Correct. Did Miss Morton call you after September? No. Did she come and see the cat after September? No, ma'am. Between August 15th and December the 1st, did you hear from Miss Morton? We had some Facebook exchanges early on the first couple of weeks letting her know how the cat was doing. In August? And the first part of September, correct. After September? Uh, after the end of September, I didn't hear from Miss Morton again until she received the notice that I had filed small claims. So you filed a small claims case against her for the hundred dollars? I for, th for the money for fostering the cat? Correct. How long did you keep the cat? I still have the cat. Do you want her to pay you for fostering the cat? I believe she should pay me for the time up to the agreement. With the original agreement ended November 30th. I believe she does owe me the fostering money for that time. Oh. Was that the original agreement? The original agreement w was supposed to end on November 30th. 